field locked up. Off and racing, a very good start, except for Liam's awesome at the back. Catch your name best away from Centenary, showing up as Super Sinclair and driving for the early lead in the centre is Trick and Treat, and on their inside, Rifling is on the pace, on the inside coming through is Baylor Be Good. They stack up in front. Adam Carr has gone through to join Catch your name in behind them, coming away from the inside, Society's Cat. Three to Liam's awesome, then I'm a Bourbon Girl who's third last from Sharp as a Rainbow, and last is Flat Out Angel. Out in front, Rifling narrowly, on the inside, Baylor Be Good, lying third, Trick and Treat, Catch your name is there, wide Super Sinclair. Adam Carras tucking in on the inside. A length and a half centenary society's cat looking for room. A gap to Liam's awesome starting to wind up. Behind them I'm a bourbon girl. Second last flat out angel and sharp as a rainbow is last. Out in front on the inside. Rifling taken on by Super Sinclair. Super Sinclair and Rifling two and a half catchy name. Adam Carrick coming off the inside running on. Rifling turns in front on the outside. Super Sinclair. This stride to stride. Three lengths away coming home well. Adam Carra is down the outside. Super Sinclair rifling, Anam Kara getting going. Super Sinclair joined by Anam Kara, and she's going to race on by Anam Kara, and it's going to be a big win. Another one, and this time stakes win. The Muskogata Anam Kara couldn't have been more impressive. A length and a half to Super Sinclair, catchy name, rifling. Out wider, I'm a bourbon girl, and then came Liam's awesome and flat out angel. 117.61. Muskoka stakes in the books here with uh, Patrick Husbands and Sarah Ritchie. What an awesome winter circle. Lots to talk about with you, Sarah. But first things first, nice ride once again, Patrick. Two for two to start her career. Um, what do you think of this filly overall as a whole? She's been so impressive in both starts. Yeah, you know, she's a happy little filly. You know, like a little, you know, she's a baby. Um, I get on her, um, under the lights when it was sad or sunny as her. And she just glided around there, and when I come back, Sarah said, you went very slow, Patrick. I said, she enjoy it. <laughs> she was happy with the ears prick, and she was just enjoying it. And when I pull her up, she was just bouncing and kicking and clearing it, like, wow. I said, Leroy, we probably got lucky again. So she won a big race today. I was concerned when I get in the gates. You know, I mind just tell me look down. I always look down. When I look down, I see the shoe halfway on. I only one more horse to load. I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> so, you know, she blows shoe, and she still showed that she was the best today. She was much the best and ended up working out a really nice trip too. A lot of speed up front and you sat just off of it and it seemed to be a perfectly mapped out trip. Was that the game plan all along? Well, you know, you kick back down the backside is pretty heavy. So she breaking, she was enjoying herself and I just dived to the wheel, which I did, did with her last time. And um, she was getting a poly in the face. She was enjoying it. And then I just tip her out the top of the lane. So she do everything professional. Thanks, Patrick. Congrats on a nice victory. Right, Got to bring in Sarah Ritchie. I was so excited for you guys. It's awesome. So much girl power going on in the winter circle too, which, which I love to see. <laughs> Your first stakes win of the year. How does it feel? Stakes win ever, actually. <laughs> it's pretty exciting. She's a really nice filly. And um, I liked her a lot right from the start and she hasn't disappointed yet. It's amazing too, because you own this horse too, train this horse, so extra special from that perspective. Uh, talk me through the race as a whole. So she was positioned well, looked to be good, but obviously when there's so much on the line with it being your <laughs> baby, um, you know, a little added bit of pressure, but you thought she was in a good spot all along? I did. Patrick did a wonderful job. I mean, broke, tucked her, tucked her in and um, popped her out and came running when it counted. I'm so happy for you. Congrats <laughs> on a huge victory. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Once again, it was Sarah Ritchie notching her first ever stakes victory with Annam Kara, Patrick Husbands. Perfectly mapped out trip to win the Muskoka.